2011, I made a um, highlight reel for you. And what has that done for you now in 2015? Um, honestly, it has got me to where I'm at now. Um, I don't think, I, I really don't think I would know where I'm at this day without that. Um, I think it really helped me because I was able to send it out to different college coaches um, to actually just put me on the basketball market. Um, not saying that I wasn't on the market already, but it actually boosted, you know, more uh, exposure for myself. Uh, after I graduated from Bowie, I actually went to um, IMG Academy in Florida. Um, IMG is just straight um, development, trying to get you to the next uh, level, which would have been college for me. I was just there just to get, you know, try to get ready for SATs and, um, you know, things like that in order to get into college. IMG is really well known, so people are, are um, they know about the fact that they, it's just straight development and players actually get good, um, get better, a lot better coming out of there. One of my good coach, friends, family type of guy, uh, Andre Johnson was the one that was getting me around to different places that were letting coaches know about, you know, who Christian Jones is. Um, so when the time came around that everybody else was signing, um, getting ready to, for colleges, I was still in the mix of trying to find what school I really want to, which school is the best fit for me. So we seen that St. John's still had, you know, a couple uh, scholarships left. Uh, Andre uh, actually sent the highlight tape that you made for me out to St. John's and he said that they called him immediately. They was like, yeah, we like the tape. Um, I think, he, you know, he can fit here well in our, you know, our basketball system. Uh, but the process, it wasn't, it wasn't like a lengthy process. I didn't have to like wait because um, then I was still training. So it wasn't like I'm, I'm stressed out just, just waiting. But um, it, was, it, was, it was pretty nice how they called back and, and told us about the video that they got. I got accustomed to being on my own. So the transition from IMG to St. John's was it, was, it was smooth. It wasn't rough. I wasn't homesick, you know, none of that. I already went through that. Um, but St. John's being a college student, like you have to be on top of everything um, because you know the next the next step is is the real world or wherever you want to go. It's, it's, it's all the real world, um, so it, it gets you ready for for you know anything to come. And final question: What what plans do you have after St. John's? Oh, uh, well, my biggest plan, my dream, is to make it to the NBA. Um, but I know that's that's you know it's, it's a low percent of, of that happening because there's so many colleges, so many college players. Um, so I actually, I, I'm, 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 my major is sports management. So if anything, if I don't, if my basketball career isn't, you know, going in the direct, right direction, I, I have something to fall on, whether it be a coach or a GM or, you know, anybody like that, that's still in the basketball industry. Um, that's something that I would pursue. And then my minor is business. So I'm taking business classes and, you know, things like that that could also help me in the future as well.